Hi everyone, this is Stocks in the Philippines teaching you how to trade and invest in the Philippine stock market independently. This is our top gainer and top loser analysis for February 8, 2018. Our top gainer is VUM, rising by 21.65%, while our top loser is RCBC, lower by 5.10%. Well, let's look at the fundamentals of the stocks. Let's start with VUM. VL had a net loss of 1.46 million for the first nine months of 2017. Thus, EPS is negative and PE cannot be computed. Book value is only at 0.59, so with a price of 1.18, the stock is trading at two times its book value. Uh, we tried to look at the disclosure section of VUL, but there is no news that might have triggered the uh, spike in the stock. And it's most or was most likely triggered by technicals since it was closing a gap. Okay, there you go. We actually estimated the resistance at 1.15, but it overshot, so we would expect that to act as uh, support now. While next resistance would be around 1.21, the stock is still above the 200 SMA. Your 15, 20, and 50 SMA are pointing upwards and may do a bullish crossover with the 200 SMA. Volume profile is supposed to be bullish outlook. Mike is bullish. RSI is also bullish. Uh, rather parabolic, but it's in overbought levels. Right? We now go to the top loser, which is RCBC. RCBC. RCBC had a net income of 3.5. 4 billion for the first nine months of 2017. EPS is at 3.25. If we annualize this EPS, a uh, full year EPS would be around 4.33. And with a price of 46.5, stock is trading at 10.73 times PE, making it undervalued. Book value is at 46.67, so the stock is fairly valued versus book value. Uh, we also checked if there was significant news affecting RCBC, but there was not. The last news I had was that uh, Bangladesh was suing the bank for the bank heist uh, two years ago. And let's check the chart of RCBC. Okay, it's weak as it makes new lower lows over a three-year period, a three-month rather, three-month period. The 15, 20, and 50 SMA has made a bearish crossover with the 200 SMA. Volume seems to side with the bears. Mac is bearish. RSI is also bearish. And it's in overbought, oversold territory. Support is at 45.12, but resistance is at 48.9. Right, so that was your top winner and top user analysis for February 8, 2018. This is Talks in the Philippines teaching you how to trade and invest in the Philippine stock market independently.